Hi everyone, today's um, box opening is going to be of um, WWE Superstars Becky Lynch doll. Um, the reason I'm opening her ahead of the other dolls is because I can't wait to get her out of the box. Yeah, simple as that. I have a pile of dolls that I need to unbox and she was at the bottom of the pile but I've brought her to the top because I can't wait to get her out of the box. Yeah, so I've got two of these. I've got Bailey. And I've got Becky. Um, so here she is in a box. There's a picture of the of actual Becky there. Look, beautiful. And then here's the doll. Her style is steampunk. She has beautiful, vibrant red hair, really pretty face. It says WW Superstars there. Becky Lynch and Six Plus on the bottom. Um, on the back. It says, there's a picture of some artwork there of Becky. Becky Lynch, signature style steampunk. Then the other three that you can get are Alicia Fox, Bailey and Charlotte Flair. Then we have all the things on here, www.com. Um, she's a Mattel doll. Yeah, so let's see if we can get her out. Now that's odd because she doesn't look as if she was attached to the box with any. And that is odd because there's two there, look, but I don't think they were actually in her head. Maybe I've forgotten that I pulled her head off there, eh? Could have done. I'm a bit daft like that, you know. Right, so here is the Becky Lynch doll. Let's have a look at her. <clears throat> Beautiful face. I love that face and I love the vibrant red hair. There's nothing in that hair. It's lovely and soft. Yeah, beautiful. She comes in this top which is silky and it's got like a design on it, a steampunk design I assume. And then this looks like a little collar at the top there. She's got articulated arms, arms and wrists, very well articulated, very muscular. She's got huge boots on. They're a funny shape, those boots, aren't they? A bit thick here, across there, I think. Maybe that's just my imagination, I don't know. Let's have a look at her feet. Yeah, she's got quite big feet. More realistically sized feet, let's say, than, than an average Barbie. Let's have a look at her. Get her undress. She's a bit, she's shaped a bit more like Bumblebee, isn't she? Like the um, superhero girls, yeah. She is. She's got articulated knees as well. Yeah, and she can sit like a lady. That's good. Because not all dollies can. Yeah, she can sit like a lady, although ladies wouldn't sit with no trousers on, would they? No. Put her trousers back on. Yeah, trousers are like a um, nylon-y, silky nylon-y fabric with an elastic waist. And she doesn't come with any accessories. She she was twenty pounds, and she is just a dress doll. That's what. Oh, hold on! I'm trying to put two two legs down one trouser leg there. That's no good, is it? No, let's pull her under crackers up. There we go. Right. Yeah, so she's got the moulded on underwear. She's got the, her body is very similar to that of the superhero girls, I think. Um, yeah, articulation in the wrist, knee and elbow. Beautiful hair. Yeah. Her feet are unusual. No, you could probably put flip-flops on them because she's got a gap between her first and second toe. Yeah. Let's try and... Put her boots on her. 
yeah they're quite big those boots aren't they real big boots yeah but yes yeah, yeah i'm really pleased to have and i can't wait to try all the clothes on so let's try her in some fashion easter clothes shall we now i've just got a dress again i'm going to undress her and try them clothes on her what a wally i am yes so i've got a tall fashion easter doll and i've got a curvy fashion easter doll um I really ought to get a standard one as well, didn't I? Let's get a standard one too. So I have got an original, a curvy and a tall fashionista and I'm going to try their clothes on the WWE doll to see how well they fit her. So here's the uh, original outfit. The shoes definitely won't fit because her feet are a lot bigger than the fashionista's feet are. You can see that they are. Look, there's a huge difference, isn't there? Massively smaller they are, the fashionista's ones, yeah. Right. So she's got the top on okay, although it is a bit shorter than it is on the original doll. Let's try the skirt. Yeah, actually they fit her fine, don't they? Apart from, like I say, that the body is a bit shorter. Let's have a look. Yeah, she is quite a lot shorter in the body, isn't she? Maybe the taller doll's clothes would fit her best. Yeah, so it, it fits a bit odd across the shoulders as well, don't you think? <clears throat> I don't think she's can be classed as curvy. I don't think she's curvy at all. She's muscular, but not... She's a, a completely different shape to the to the curvy fashion Easter, isn't she? Yeah, so I think the curvy doll's dress is going to be too big for her, but we'll try it on anyway. I do like to know what, what fits who, you know. I do indeed. So let's try her. Wow, that really clashes with her hair, that top does. I didn't think about that very well, did I? Actually, she can get away with that fine. Yeah, she really can. Apart from it, it clashes with her top, yeah. Yeah, yeah, she can get away with that. A bit loose, but no, nothing really, because she's quite muscular and broad across the shoulders. It doesn't look bad on her at all. So, yeah, she can, she can get away with that. And then finally, I'm going to try her in the tall fashion Easter Barbie's dress. And this is not stretchy at all, this dress isn't. It's like a thin, well, it's like a poly cotton fabric. So let's see. Let's have a look, compare them side by side. Yeah, you can see the t body length, they're, they're more or less exactly the same. Although the, fash though the wrestling doll... The Becky Lynch doll is a bit, little bit longer in the leg, but only slightly. And I think she's probably a bit thinner in the waist. But yeah, uh, she might have a bit of a bigger bust. She might be a bit more busty. Let's try this dress on her and see if it fits her. So I think body type wise, she is nearer to the tall doll than she is to any of the others. She's certainly not... Um, in the petite she's a lot taller than the petite dolls she's um a little bit taller than the original um the curvy clothes did fit her she could get them on and do you know i don't know if she's going to get this tall one on you know 
because it's got no stretch in it. I'm not sure it'll go over her shoulders. No, it probably won't. Oh no, hold on. No, I, I have got it on her, no problem at all. Yeah, no, that does fit her and then it fits her fine. Yeah, I think out of the three we've tried, I think the tall one probably does fit her best of all. Yeah. So that's my unboxing and review to, for today. Uh, WWE Becky Lynch. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.